Hey guys, this episode we're gonna be talking about a code review on the receipts gem. And specifically what I wanna talk about in this episode is the idea of writing your code to perfectly mirror the real world and how that almost never makes sense in the long term. So let's talk about that. When I wrote the receipts gem, I had a PDF I wanted to render for a receipt, which had a logo, it had an ID, a message, the company name, the support email address, some line items of details about the receipt, and the company address and information at the bottom. Now, over time, there are other things that come up and you're like, oh, we need to insert that into the receipt. Or maybe we need an invoice and it needs some other fields. And so it's kind of like a receipt, but we really need like a more um, different format for it. So we have the line items on there. Heck, maybe we want those line items on the receipt itself. And there's no good way of having these like column, two column things and adding the four column um, items in here onto the receipt and I realized that, you know, this is one of those cases where I took an example and I had a design of that receipt or, you know, a web um, design from a designer and I took it and I made it exactly as is. I made it very strict and tried to perfectly model out what are the exact things we need in a receipt or an invoice or a statement. And the reality is, uh, we'd never really know that. So when I wrote the invoice,